The world of a first grader is equal parts wonder, discovery, and imagination. The media specialist and teacher team at Murray Centennial Public School in Trenton, Ontario used inventive technology to help their students explore and discover the world around them and ways that could give voice to their lively imaginations. When Ontario's Ministry of Education rolled out a new social studies program, the team believed that students should be able to recognize physical and man-made features in their community, the amalgamated city of Quinty West. They wanted students to demonstrate mapping skills and understand compass directions. They also wanted them to think about social responsibility as it related to the places they were discovering. Technology, they all agreed, represented the best way to engage their students. That decision propelled these young learners into the fascinating, cutting-edge phenomenon known as augmented reality. So stand up and put your, your iPad in front of it. And look what happens. Hi, so I'm going to tell me. And why would you add a pond? Because... It began when grade one students explored the Quinty West community through videos and mapping activities. Each student next imagined a new feature that would enhance Quinty West. They illustrated their vision. They supported their thinking. They served as spokespeople in their own videos as they described the what, the where, and the why of their imagined new feature. They shared their learning with one another. Then each created a 3D presentation, an augmented reality view of their particular project using the Erasma application. Erasma uses trigger images to prompt its multimedia magic. These pictures, along with the students' own drawings, had the makings of an excellent art fair, the team decided. So the gallery walk was born. Of course, they would invite parents and families, but they didn't stop there. The mayor and counselors of Quinty West, the members of the public library, the director and superintendent of education were all officially invited, and everybody came. More than 100 guests packed the gallery walk to marvel at the astonishing audiovisual experience. But mostly, they were impressed by the creativity that these young thinkers had demonstrated as they imagined how they might make their community better. If you're swimming at the Y and it's almost time to go to school, you can ride it all the way to Murray. They just throw their little equipment in there and people can come in and buy stuff. There will be chairs, books, shelves for books. There will be an office so if people get hurt, someone can help them. A soccer field. A soccer field. And why did you think a soccer field was important? Uh, because you can get energy. You can get faster. The revised curriculum's expectations had undoubtedly been met. Oh, yeah. But the real result could be seen in the delight of students and the practical, imaginative, and transformative solutions they had proposed for change within their own community. They were more in touch with the world immediately around them, but more importantly, well prepared to have a positive influence on the greater world they will ultimately inherit, thanks to the media specialist and teacher team at Murray Centennial Public School.